you. What's going on, everyone? This is Backward Noise, episode 406, and I am joined by Nathan. Howdy. Pi. Hello. And Kyle. Hi. And good morning, Ashley. How's you? I am alright. I just ate, so I'm currently happy. I most I think I'm most happy during the eating and right after the eating. What do you have? I had some barbecue. Ooh. Yeah. We um we got from uh, a local place and they have uh, something aptly named a pig out platter and uh my brother, dad and I like split it up. It was delicious. And I do feel I feel like it's a little rude to call it a pig out platter cuz I I don't know math. But I'm pretty sure some of those things come from a pig. Makes sense. Actually, I don't know that for a fact. Pork is a pig, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So pulled pork is pig. Yeah. Some barbecue. Kyle, did you get a chance to eat? Yeah, I had uh, roast beef potatoes. Oh. Nice. Uh, Nathan and Pi, have you eaten? Uh, yes. What did you have? <laughs> uh, Taco Bell, because Word. apparently I don't have any regard Did you get a Baja Blast? Stomach. I did. That's yeah. the funny thing, is because we were talking about it the other day, I was thinking, and I'm like, there's a Taco Bell literally three minutes down the road from my house. And I was like, mm, oh, that's, Baja that's Blast, right actually. There. Yeah. I want to do it. So I did. I respect every, you. Every time I go there, I always bring Bear with me. And they always oh. are like, oh my god, your little passenger is so cute. Like, thanks. One time a lady called him a co-pilot and I about cried. Was... Yeah, that's adorable. Yeah. Uh, yep. Very, very adorable co-pilot. If needed to actually fly your car, uh, you would be in danger, though. Yes. <laughs> 100% Is he fly your car? Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> pilot. Sure. pilot, yeah. <laughs> um... Nathan, did you say that you've eaten? Uh, I didn't say that I did, but I have. Okay. What I, you, I think I, I like yawned into the mic. I okay. Think that's, that's I heard like a good. little little something something, but I'm like I don't know yeah. if that was a a yeah, a nah, or a Tony go fuck yourself. So it was one of the three, but it wasn't actually any of those three. So it was very wrong. I don't know if I've ever said that third one. Yeah, I hope not, but... <laughs> Sorry, that's my brain. Sorry. Uh, that's that's what I say inside my head. Um, think, so what did I you have I for dinner? I, I had breakfast, but I think I, I can actually boast a very low tally for the amount of people I've told to fuck off. Oh. I would like to just say that I'm going to guess that Pi and Kyle cannot say the same. <laughs> no. Do I need... Think about me, Tony. <laughs> Why would I say something so true? As Ashley redeems three quacks. <laughs> Little extra in there. Um, I have never. I have told very few people to go fuck off, except myself. To be completely honest. So there's that. I, can I probably... have a longer list. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Yeah. No way. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a good noodle sometimes. Totally <laughs> don't I, try to start fights. Nope. I didn't throw you and Kyle under the bus immediately <laughs> because I. <laughs> I mean, fair. You're not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna deny it. Ashley said she loves the extra quacks. I'm glad you did. I am a quack after all. Because I'm crazy. Okay. I was playing a game of Valorant last night, and uh, the person kept saying, "Yo, you're crazy," and I'm like, "And he's like, no, you're insane," and I'm like, "Uh huh, uh huh," and then he's like, "Yeah, you're legally insane. You should go into a mental institute." It's like this is going like very deep. <laughs> I was playing. Dude, you along belong with it. in a loony bin. Yeah. You shouldn't be around people. It's like, oh god, you're a danger to yourself. <laughs> you're <society>. a <da> yeah. <laughs> and then I just kept, sa I just kept agreeing with it. Like I kept going along with it. But I, uh, I was like, yep, I actually am not playing Valorant. Um, I'm in a white cozy room right now. Um, and at least in my mind, I play well. When, 
at least when I make up Valorant in my mind while I'm in a loony bin, at least I'm playing well. It'd really be unfortunate, even with the made-up scenario in your mind, you were bottom fragging. Oh. <laughs> Ashley said, I'm gonna go lurking because I forgot I was in call with people. Oh. Good luck. Have fun. And most importantly, did you answer the question, Lee? Because I haven't asked it yet, Ashley. Please, Keep please answer on the ice. Oh. oh. <laughs> so, our question of the week. Wait, what question? The question of the week in the title of the stream is, what is your go-to movie theater snack? So if you were to go to the movies, or I'll even say, like, if you were to do a at-home movie, what are you, what are you doing? What, what is your go-to? Ooh, salty popcorn? Nice. Nice. One thing for me, uh... I need, like, a soda of some kind if I'm sitting down for a movie. It's just it's part of the process. Just need a nice soda. Uh, when you go to the movie theater, you get the, like, what, probably, like, 2,000 calorie soda size. Oh, those things are huge. Just, but I do it anyway. And you always have to pee, like, halfway through the movie, but I always just tough it out and finish the movie. Yep. That's what an adult does, is just tough yeah. it out. yeah. And then you pee after the movie. And then uh, if you have a friend with you, you ha you ask them, could you please hold the uh, three quarters of my soda left while I go yeah. and pee real fast? <laughs> <laughs> so. That's never yeah. really fast, dude. Like no. an after movie pee, it's yeah. fucking at least like a couple minutes. Yeah, you're in there for... You know how, like, some bodies of water have very steady uh, streams or currents? I think that's very relatable to your after movie. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> uh, and Ashley said, I think the saltier popcorn is better than the sweet popcorn. And okay, back to Lurk. Love you. Love you too, Ash. I can't stand sweet popcorn. I don't really know if I've ever had sweet popcorn. There's one type of sweet popcorn that I actually like. Oh, is it caramel corn? Yeah, okay, maybe I have had it. Well, the one that I found, I've literally been able to find it in one grocery store within 200 miles of me. <laughs> and it's this, like, marshmallow type. And it's so delicious. And I don't know how to describe it other than just, like... I'm pretty sure it's not delicious as a sugar candy. Marshmallow popcorn is what it is? Yeah. What is, like, what's, like, the brand? Do you know? No. Oh. <laughs> if, I, if I find it, let me, let me look for it. Let me see if I can find it online. I do love that. What, do you know what the brand is? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, Kyle. Hmm. What is your go-to movie theater snack? Aside from popcorn, I'm... You could say popcorn. Say nibs, I think. What are Nibs. What are those? Uh, like cherry licorice. Oh. No, that's exactly what they are. They look like um, tiny Twizzlers. Yeah, except you can get them long, so they're not like, you okay. them, like normal size. So it's Twizzlers, basically. But better. it's licorice, like, right? Far, far better. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's a good show. Um. My uh, other countries have them. Do, they not, do you not have it at nibs? We not do. like called nibs. Um, like I'm saying, like we have uh, Twizzlers. No, that's not the same thing. That's like, yeah. not even close to the same thing. Like it's completely different. Okay, then say, no, I've, we don't have nibs. I mean, I do here. I've had them before because they're right. like the East Coast does not have nibs. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I'm in the same time zone. I'm like two hours away. From the here. U.S. East Coast does not. Because <laughs> <laughs> aren't nibs like? Aren't they actually? the Twizzlers brand, but they're, like, smooth instead of with the ridges. Kind of? Yeah. Well, because, like, the ones I'm I seeing say... Like, it doesn't even taste the same, though. Like, it's not even, like, the same kind of liquor. The ones I'm seeing right. say Twizzler nibs, but I assumed it was something different for Kyle. Maybe they bought them? I'm not sure. I don't think they used to. Because I also found a packaging that just says nibs on it, and I'm Yeah, that's what I'm used to. <laughs> um, is there a camel in the back? No. Maybe? Okay. I, don't, I don't know. It's been a while. Okay. I, don't think, I don't remember there being a camel anywhere in or around. 
uh, do you know the company that made it? I can't recall. Oh, this is said. This is from the seventies. So you know, Kyle's not that old. So, sounds like me. <laughs> yeah, the only other nibs I can find are Twizzlers. Yeah, I'll say same. But I found the marshmallow popcorn. Ooh. So it is jolly time, but like <coughs> I can't find it literally anywhere. But it comes with this like marshmallow cream stuff that you put on the popcorn, which is disgusting. But the popcorn itself just tastes like a, a rice krispie treat, but in popcorn oh. form, and it's delicious. They have a website. You have a website. Kind of. Onlyfans.org. Yeah, yeah it's going to say, like, well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Nathan. Yep. I have a very important question to ask you, and I totally am only asking you this. What's your guarantee right. movie theater stack? <laughs> uh, I don't. Oh. Uh, I usually just get, like, a soda. Okay. That's the same, to be honest. If What about, oh. does it change if you're home to watch a movie? Uh, like, if no. you sat down. Okay, interesting. You wouldn't be like, okay. cookie. Yeah, I didn't know if, like, yeah, you're turning the cookie monster, like Kyle's saying. Like, <laughs> I used to, used to get popcorn. And then I was like, popcorn is for babies. It's for babies. <laughs> <laughs> so I just fucking got real emo with it, I guess. <laughs> I'll be got honest, real this is the first, the movie first time I've heard someone be really edgy about popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want people thinking I'm like a kid or something. <laughs> I, I don't know why I pictured, but you know like Tobey Maguire's hair in Spider-Man 3. <laughs> Like, I pictured, like, a hair flip with that kind of hair as you say that. Like, <laughs> no. you'll think I'm a child flips hair. No. How old are you, 13? <laughs> on, on the opposite end of that spectrum, I guess, I do fucking love popcorn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, a lot of fucking love popcorn, man. Like it's great. I uh, <laughs> I still want people to know how much I love it. I was actually I, I like it so much that I was, I had a thought the other day while I was eating some popcorn sitting at my desk. I was like, man, I feel like there's really like an untapped market for popcorn, where like they could do all these different flavors that like chips are doing, but on yeah. popcorn. Say more, I'm not taking notes. <laughs> <laughs> There's an intern market. Yeah, what's up? I fixed my DPI in League. Oh, so now it's uh, very high. Mm -hmm. Probably. Nice. Congratulations. Are you saying you want to play League again? Maybe. No? Oh. Um, I don't remember if I finished saying it, but other than soda, I like, um, like Swedish Fish Hell or, yeah. like, Mike and Ike's. Hell yeah. Or, like, my two go-to. They don't have either. I, I'm, I'll rock with, like, a Sour Patch Kids. I, I, I can do it. But that is a, a solid third option. Acceptable, um, but not first choice. Yeah. yeah. Like, Sour Patch Kids are still really good. First they're sour, and then they're sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Often I'll get Mike and Ike's and Sour Patch Kids. That's a great combo. Not I a movie theater, that. but I like just... Just, yeah. yeah. Yeah, this is devotion into candy talk, by the way. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> or snack talk, because popcorn's not a candy, it's a snack, I guess. Because it's you not a chip. candy corn, though, right? I like candy corn. Popcorn can be chips. Oh, can it? They make, that, they make those now, yeah. Oh, pop chips. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. But, like, what is popcorn classified as? Because it's not a chip, right? Normally. Um, not a candy. Yes. I think it's just its own, like, denomination of snack, like like chips like are. A, like a pretzel, too. It's in the chip it's aisle. <laughs> I guess yeah. so. But pretzels are, like, made out of bread, right? Yes. Well, chips are made out of oh. corn. Like popcorn is, right? Chips? Yeah. 
Chips are made from potatoes. I thought it was corn. Oh, so Doritos don't cornmeal, aren't they? Yeah, because that's a tortilla. Chip. Oh, the corn chips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking of. Sorry. I, I okay. immediately thought Dorito when I thought chip, and then I forgot like Lay's existed. <laughs> <laughs> See, I was like on the complete opposite spectrum of that. That's fair. That's fair. I, was, I was like just like, snacking literally on Lay's chips, last you night. Fucking idiot, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like completely forgot like corn chips existed. Yeah, my mind went to like a normal like potato potato chip. Um, I haven't had those in a long time. <laughs> 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 I, just, I, just, I see. Uh, <laughs> um, all right, yeah, I feel like this must be ass. What's your go-to potato chip or chip? It could be a tortilla chip as well. Oh, okay. so you're those Dorito guy. Questions. All right, your favorite chip. Ruffles all dressed. So it's not Doritos. Uh, sometimes Doritos. Depends. <laughs> what a what's the depending factor? Uh, yes. Okay. Very well said. Thank you. Whichever one I see first, usually. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I don't know why, but I do like the idea of foodsters watching Kyle, and then they. I know Kyle doesn't. You know. Do his own groceries. I like, really wish they didn't. Yeah, and, <laughs> <laughs> but the, yeah, that's fair. But then they put like the chips at your eye level, so, <laughs> so you see them immediately when you walk in. <laughs> yeah, the people, like at the place that we're going to are at that. Mm. Like they're literally like first on the corner at eye Weird. level. It's just like, well, <laughs> Weird. I wonder why they did that. <laughs> no, they've always been like that there at that place. Are you sure? Yeah. Can't confirm. <laughs> Because <laughs> if it changed, I wouldn't be going there anymore. Oh, fair. Because <laughs> Kyle also doesn't like change. <laughs> Nathan, what's your go-to potato chip? Oh, uh, probably just Lay's classic. Nice. Classic play. Not even classic. Munchos. Oh, what is a Muncho? Oh. Muncho. Why does that sound familiar? Muncho. They're like, like a classic. It's literally just like potato chip with salt, but like. Oh wait a second. It's a different kind of chip. If that makes sense, I don't know. It's weird. They have. have It's like a different brand. Yeah. The the chip is just different. That's all. Oh okay. And Frito Lay also makes them. So. Yeah. Um, I don't know. If you like Lay's classic, you should probably give those a shot. There has this is... been oh man, there's there's this brand of chips that I've been following for a while because I've been wanting to try them, <laughs> but you have to like order them and have them shipped and all this, and <laughs> you know, it's that's like a a lot of work for it's chips. It's like a whole thing. Yeah. 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 But they're they're called Wild W I L D E. Okay. Like that 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 dude, who's that famous? Like dude? Olivia Wilde. <laughs> oh. There's no. There's like a. My English teacher talked about this guy all the time. I imagine it's just like an English teacher thing where they just like love. What was his name? If it's a writer, I literally won't. Is it a poet? (laughs) Yeah. It's an Irish Uh, poet because I googled Wild and someone called Oscar Wilde. Oscar. That's his name. Yeah. Yeah. They're Irish poets. Yeah. Um, but they they make their chips out of chicken. What? Instead of potato. Oh. Oh, I want that. They, they do all these different flavors, <laughs> dude. Hold up, I'm lo- I'm staring at it right now. I'm on their website. This looks fucking amazing. I get that uh, here. There's so many different flavors. Build your box. Hold up. Wild chips. I have that here. Right. There's a chicken and waffles flavor. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Yo, the chicken waffles flavor is gluten free. Wait, all of their chips are gluten free. Yeah, because it's chicken. Oh, it's, yeah, <laughs> I'm just not you like I'm not used to seeing that for like good flavors of chips. Like so many flavors of chips, uh, they don't do that. Like it's just you know. Wow. Why does it only say state? Why does why can't I? Why does it only say state? <laughs> <Get fun>. <laughs> <laughs> why, does, why can't I? 
free shippings on orders over fifty dollars. Interesting. Interesting. Um, I'm I'm concerned. I don't see a price. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you gotta you gotta add stuff to your cart and then they'll start showing you. Yeah, there's nothing near. Okay, well, it says country Canada. Okay, okay, okay. But nothing in Ottawa. <laughs> oh. Ha. Ah. Okay. Thanks, store locator. Better make me upset. Mm. Want a chicken chip. I kind of want this. I might be ordering this as, like, we're doing the podcast, though. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like they're either going to be really good or really, really bad. Really bad, yeah. Yeah, there's, like, no in between. I don't know, like, yeah, I hope they're really good, though. I think, they, I mean, they seem, like, they look good, you know? I yeah. want it. Where's the other, where's the other flavors? Uh, hit build your box. Oh, your box. that's so expensive. Yeah, for six bags, it's like, I think, what was it, 30 or 40 yeah. bucks? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, these wow. flavors are concerning. <laughs> At least some of them. I don't want Pisces. <laughs> yeah, like, there, there are some that I'm like, you know, I. Uh, I don't like three of these, just spicy. Or four of them. Nashville hot. Yeah. Jalapeno. Yeah. Well, I don't. Oh, chili. This no, chili lime. lime. I don't think chili lime. Oh, no. it's like a. That looks like there's a jalapeno on on the yeah. bag. Maybe yeah. it is. I didn't think a uh, chili lime. I think it would be more like the lime flavor. What's, your, what's sweet chipotle? What's that mean? It's sweet. I really don't know. Chipotle. Chipotle ah. peppers, but <laughs> sweet. Concern. I'll just get the salt and vinegar. <laughs> There's literally sugar on the sweet chipotle ones. Coconut palm sugar too. Huh. Oh, this is this is missing some flavors. There's like a Himalayan pink salt one. I saw that. I don't know what that means, but I want it. Maybe the, you can only get those in like the. Oh, there's a buffalo and chicken one. Black as well. pepper bacon? Hell yeah. That, that does all good. flavored pork variety pack? An all flavored chicken pack? Oh, here we go. Shop now. And you just chose yeah. you everything. Yeah. Oh, a bunch of these are sold out. Well, not a bunch, but a few. Looks like I'm spending money today. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get my pink salt. Unless I get a small bag, I guess. Yes. Wait, how big are these bags? How big are these bags? I didn't look. I seem like individual that, sized. That is something I would like to know is how big are the bags. I assume standard chip sizes. Yeah, it looks like they're standard like chip bags. How many grams does it say on the bag? Uh, I can only see sixty-four grams. Oh, those are what? Tiny. Yeah, it's uh, only two point two five ounces for uh, Americans. Yeah, that's it's a lot for chips. They're also hot. They're high in protein. What sixty-four grams is not the low in carbs. Chips, no, I mean the price. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's very expensive. Yeah. I really want to buy them, but I'm going to think about it. <laughs> I'm leaving this tab open. Uh, it's, the, the back of the bag says serving size is 20 chips, and servings per container is about two. So, uh, oh, <laughs> those are small bags. Yeah. Oh, no. 40. You get about 40, 40 chips. chips. For, like, 20 bucks. <laughs> Jesus. I think it said it was like five dollars a bag. Oh, yeah, once four you and a half. Divide yeah, it out. Yeah. yeah. But they're like tendies, you know. That's <laughs> true. Crispy tendies. <laughs> I've been actually meaning to order. So, like, have you guys ever had hers chips? I don't I think, think so. this is uh, like a region exclusive thing. I've um, definitely heard of it. Okay. Because hers is, like, they are located on the East Coast, and, like, you can actually, like, buy, like, chips from the factory, like, sort of like this, and they'll, they'll send them to you. But, like, for example, 42 bags of, like, a variety pack, and, like, you can, like, pick and choose, is, like, 30 bucks. 
Oh, so same price as six. Yeah. From this company. Okay. Yeah, but like a whole animal versus a potato. Yeah. I'd rather have a potato. I think I'd... I, so like, I really, really, really <laughs> want to try, um, the, um, the chicken ones, but I'm like, I could just do this and like, you know, just, uh, why is there a pop-up like that just says snacks? They're going to be good to do once, you know? Sure. Just to like, have done it. They make really good ketchup chips. Ah, I hate ketchup chips. You hate <laughs> ketchup chips? Yeah. What are that's so, your culture? Yeah, it's your. That's where. That's where no, you're from. No, all dressed. All dressed are Canadian. Fuck. No, it's ketchup for her as well. No. <laughs> I don't like them. That doesn't mean Never they're not them. from you. Look, if you're just because you don't. Teen, you have to claim the ketchup chips too. You can't have only the good things. You can. No. Yeah, you like guys you... can keep Slim Dion, it's fine. Alright, then you have to keep Justin Bieber. No, oh. you ruined him. You took a sweet boy on YouTube, and you did that. <laughs> well, probably, but like, I'm still, uh, he still was born where you're from. <laughs> it's not fair. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> In the kindest way, get fucked. <laughs> turned him into this thing. I don't know what you're talking about. He was so innocent. Yeah, probably. I mean, I don't really. Uh, We're gonna keep Chad and uh, Avril, though. You know. Who? The guy from Nickelback. Oh. Oh, you can keep. Oh, you want to keep the guy from Nickelback? Oh, yeah, we're so upset. You get the guy from Nickelback. Good job, Kyle. Literally, oh, what a pick. He's literally a Chad Tony. Okay. Yeah, he's yeah, but like, no. <laughs> and he was dating Avril Lavigne for a while. Like Avril Lavigne, I'm like, uh, I we would take Avril Lavigne, but like, uh, <laughs> Chad, you want? I mean, like, if Nickelback only performed in Canada for the rest of their career, I wouldn't be. Sad. Oh no, 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 no! He still has to perform in America. <laughs> no, no, you. If you take him, you get all of his performances. No, no, no. You have to. No, you can't have half of the cow and then say like, oh, this other half of the cow's going to America. That's a fucking two halves of a cow. That's a dead cow, Kyle. You can't have a dead cow. Are like, uh, you gonna get milk? <laughs> don't sing over here. <laughs> we don't want that. Didn't you just say we could have Celine Dion? Now she lives here too. Yeah, but you said we had to. Have who? Celine Dion. No, I no, I said you have to have Justin Bieber. Oh. Celine Dion's fine. Uh. She did the theme mm. for Deadpool too. I'm okay with her. I don't care what she did. <laughs> Titanic. I know, I know. Yeah, she also did Titanic. Yeah, of course. But uh, she's done those two things and didn't care about her personal life at all. So you're saying that her contributions were enough? You should hate the music, to be honest. <laughs> those two songs are great. What? Mm. My Heart Will Go On? Yeah. You, d you think that's not a good song? I think it's awful. I think you're awful. <laughs> 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 you see what it's done to people? <laughs> they what try and it? sing it. Oh, <laughs> okay. Sorry, I think it's a good song when um, she sings it. I think it's sings caused it. more harm than good. <laughs> yeah. Did you ever I just, like... like, sit there and listen to it? Like, is that, like, one of your go-to songs to listen to? What is this? <laughs> Who, me, or...? Yeah. yeah. No, it's just a good song. Well, yeah, like, you ever, you have, have, like, have you only seen Titanic, like, once in your life? Yeah. Oh, that's... I used fun. to have it on VHS. yeah. It was on like three of them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Three of them once? Huh. Yeah, That's I saw it once really, when I was. It's a like, very, very successful movie. I think I was like 14 or something. Very, very famous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was the number one movie for like, a very okay. long time. <laughs> yeah, it came out. Okay, like, tell me she's a hipster. You have to understand. Uh, oh, oh sorry. Yeah. My bad. <laughs> so, do you care about things that are good just because they're highly rated? <laughs> oh, so that's how it came up right. before I was born. Good like... to know, though, that like <laughs> they, that you just have like the hipster taste and things. So, Correct. Like I know when the gauge... not like it because it's highly rated. Okay. No, not everything. <laughs> so, I, what's an example of something you don't like because it's highly rated? Adele. 
Yeah, you don't like Adele. Like, so, Adele. You don't like Adele because she's highly rated, or you don't like Adele? <laughs> Both. Originally, okay. I didn't like Adele because I was like in high school and she got popular, and then I was like, everyone likes Adele? Fuck Adele, she sucks. And then now I listen to her and I just don't like her music. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, Kelly makes me listen to it all the time, which makes me hate it even fall? more. Yes. 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 Okay, yeah, I don't like her either. <laughs> I think she has some good music and she's a good singer but like I, she, she's not my favorite of all time if you said I sam don't... smith sucked i'd throw hands so. <laughs> up fair that's that's okay if kyle says who it's okay that means he, he doesn't outright outright hate him so that's fine for me with kyle <laughs> <laughs> okay my thing with adele is like i objectively she does have a good voice i just don't yeah. like her music at all yeah same like i think nathan was gonna say sam smith also did a he did um, a 007. He did the writings on the wall. Yeah. Oh, that's never... different speed. What? Oh, that's Riders on the Storm. Okay, never mind. Okay. Do you care? <laughs> <laughs> did I you hit your head today? Are you fine? Okay. Yep. Just want to make sure. It's worried for you for a second. Did it don't have a new album come out, or is that coming out soon? I don't know. Uh, I don't know I, if it's actually out. I've been seeing things about her, and I hadn't seen anything about her in like a couple of years. So, what other popular Adele. things don't you like? Uh, that's just the first one that always comes to mind. I don't know. Like, I can't think that of anything me. off the top of my head. Oh, it's a remix of it, I guess, or like a. Because that originally was just a Doris song. Your what? The song you sent. It was originally just a Doris song. Oh. I've only heard it this version. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll have to listen to it off stream, of course. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, that's interesting. I'll I've, I've only heard this version, is it? <laughs> I didn't know this original until I looked it up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah the Doris, um,. Were a very popular band back when my parents were younger. Yeah. So that's the only reason I know them is because your parents yeah, have a tendency also to. Yeah, likes them because yeah. he's like that. Oh. <laughs> he owns vinyls. Oh yeah, so that one of those yeah. people. Yeah. I got it. Yeah. <laughs> you know, different uh, folks have different strokes. Is what they say sometimes. The strokes is also a band. Yeah, that's true. Very true. Also, that new Adele album is coming out uh, the 19th of November. Oh. She had one single come out in the last, like, week or two, but... Oh, yeah, it looks like there's two singles out total. There you go. Good for her, I think. Yeah. Hope they're good. Unless, All uh, about her divorce. So. One, of, one of them. I didn't even know she was married. I Unless... didn't either. <laughs> well, now she's divorced, so technically yeah. she's not. So you're. So right. I. Yeah. Well, I mean... <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, so then you're technically right. She's not married. She's not. So I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Who was she married to? No clue. Oh, that's a weird name. <laughs> yep. Oh, marriage. Simon Konecki. Oh, uh, yeah, I have no idea who that is. Yes, yeah, who's saying? Yeah. Next Google search, who is this guy? <laughs> his, his title is Adele's ex husband on Google. Is he oh. really? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Rough, buddy. Poor guy, he was just trying to be a dude. Never again will he just be a dude. He it's was married from... to Carrie Fisher before he was married to Adele. Wait, Claire... what? Clary Hold Fisher. On. Clary Fisher. My okay. Bad. I That's what a we what a handle, dude. <laughs> <laughs> who's okay? Who's Clary Fisher? I don't know who that is. She's oh, a it's... fashion designer. Oh, do you want to know what's fucked up about her? Uh, Clary what's... Fisher. The first thing that pops up about her is that she's uh, this guy's ex-wife. <laughs> oh, is this a rabbit hole? Is he? Yeah, the first thing was like Clary Fisher, Simon Konecki's ex-wife. That's fucked, dude. So it's a rabbit hole. He's just known as Adele's ex-husband, but this lady is just known as 
<laughs> his, his ex-wife. <laughs> so it's, does she, how many times was she married? Is there someone who's known as exclusively her ex? There's just, like, nothing on her. He has to say. Uh, <laughs> there is, like, who is Clary Fisher? Uh, there's yeah. articles. Um, and people don't know. <laughs> Oh, wait a second. Oh, she is married. Yeah, it's gonna look, I'm Googling this person now. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, this is horrible. whatever. <laughs> is that who you're Googling? Or? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so he, he apparently has a little corner of his own fame because it doesn't pop up as Paul Cullicut. Uh, Cullicut. Um, blah, blah, blah's ex, what? Hex, no, current husband, sorry. Be funny if on his own website, though, he was like, I am this person's... <laughs> no, he it's, it doesn't say that. He writes um, children's books. Not good for him. Huh. Oh, There's... so he... Do you, do you see the titles of these? <laughs> yes, they're so... <laughs> so great. So he... Paul Collicut. I'm going to call him Collicut until someone corrects me, which I, no one knows who he is, so no one will. Um, yep. Have has made a series of books called This Plane, This Train, oh my. This Truck, This Boat, <laughs> This Rocket, This Car. <laughs> a few of them, I guess that was a series. Um, at one point, because he had six boats with this, or six boats, six books. <laughs> <laughs> he has six boats, look at him go! Uh, no, he has... Uh, yeah. What a weird rabbit hole from candy and chips. <laughs> but it, yeah, probably it not like, like an Adele. Funnier. Yeah. I don't. Did what you say you think something? Of, um, the Departed. I what is, is that? Reply. Movie. Wait, what? It's a movie. Uh, I've never seen it. Wait. I feel like you would remember The Departed if you've seen it. You've definitely 2006. seen it. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, I have seen it. <laughs> <laughs> I've definitely seen it. it was How good. did it make you feel? Um, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't remember how it made me feel. What did I you think of it? Fight Club? I liked Fight Club. Those are like two very highly rated movies. <laughs> I'm not, so, like I said, I don't hate everything. I will let you know that like. there was a wrong answer to that second one. Oh. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> <laughs> that would include I mean, being blocked by Kyle on multiple platforms. Yep. <laughs> I mean, I literally watched Fight Club for the first time. Like, <laughs> what, like a month ago? A month and a half ago? Imagine <laughs> if you said you hated it. It is actually <laughs> the only movie I own. I love that about you. <laughs> <laughs> it's only when he needs. <laughs> Correct. The world ends, and like somehow he has a, a player working. Ed Norton. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So many flavors of chips, man. I want some chicken chips, though, now. Fuck. I do, but they're so expensive. <laughs> they're very expensive. They could be worth it to do ones. <sighs> Splurge, Tony. Maybe. Or you just ask for him for Christmas. <laughs> Can I have this chip? How much is it? No. Oh. It's... Uh... You're 25 years old, Tony. Stop asking for chips no. for Christmas. <laughs> you know what's really funny about that? For my birthday, my parents... <laughs> My mom gave me a bag, and she was like, I didn't know what to get you, so here's just, like, a bunch of snacks. I was like, <gasps> cool, it works for me, and gave me, like, Beautiful. a bunch of, like... Beautiful. I'm really happy. Yeah. yeah. It was great. Because they helped me pay for a couple parts for my PC, so mm. they were like, we're not going to get you anything. And I'm like, that's fine. And then she just showed up with a bunch of bags of chips. I'm like, this is great. <laughs> this is this is everything I could have asked for, thank you. <laughs> this is the best day. Okay, wait, how can I... How can you what? Tell us, Kyle. 
Oh. You're such a cheater. Thank you for the three bits. Why do you keep calling him a cheater when he does three bits? What does because, this do? Because he gets points. So the thing is, every like the first cheer of every month, you get more points in the channel. So every time he's donating three bits, he's getting points for it. So he's winning too, because that's three cents for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's literally just bits I have left over from like whatever the fuck. Oh is. shit! Kyle gifted five tier one gift subs. Thank you, Kyle. <laughs> right there. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> to Mr. Chef Piggy, Axel Bubble, Colin, Mecca, and Ugly Dead Cat, who I uh, always say he was a very pretty cat every time they're here. Nice. Thank you, Kyle. Yeah. I'm at 120. Get fucked, Aries. Yeah, Aries. Where I don't think Aries has passed 100, right? No. Well, he, he is. He did do I think, on, but he's still yeah, out of him from that. He um, is, I think, most of, if not all, of the anonymous gifted subs. Oh. I think he's probably like 10 of them. <laughs> yeah. Because I think someone else might have given an anonymous before, but I forget. Someone said they did, I think. I forget who it was. Limbo. I guarantee it was Limbo. It could have been. He likes to do that. He doesn't like taking credit for it. So, like, he's done it in the past where he's uh, either donated or gifted anonymously or put down somebody else's name. Like, he's put down my name a couple times. And That's funny. I, yeah. I, he did it to you one time. Did he actually? Yeah, he donated to you, but said it was from me. You know what? <laughs> I some yeah, actually, you know, I, I did get a donation from um you once and it had it said the name Dustin on the receipt. <laughs> yeah. And I wanted to ask you oh, no. about that. And, <laughs> but I never did. <laughs> yeah. That's why you thought you had a penis. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey Lena, what's up Lena? How is your evening going? And Lena, we have a question of the week for the podcast. What is your go to movie theater snack? People in here had said popcorn. Someone said soda. Someone said Swedish fish and Mike and Ike's. Someone said a four course meal. No one said that when I lied. I'm sorry. <laughs> really there are movie theaters where you can like sit down and yeah, yeah, eat like a full meal at. I've never done that. Have you guys? Oh yeah. How is it? It's mm, the one that I go to, like the food's really expensive, but it's good. Like they have like trouble. Is it fries good expense? And, oh, so it's yeah. like it's that's that's kinda of bougie, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like kinda of, yeah. Yeah. They also have alcohol, it's great. Soda or pretzels. Ooh, that's a good shout. Oh, pretzels actually. Pog. Yeah, yeah that's a good, good shout. Great, great shout. I just get pretzels before I go to the movie theater. Oh, so like I will be honest here. When I said Swedish fish and um Mike and Ike's, I usually stop at like a dollar store. <laughs> right before. Oh, you're one of those. You yeah. have to. Yeah. I buy so the soda funny. from the movie theater because it's just the novelty of getting the soda that's the size of my head that I enjoy. Correct. But, um, you know what? Actually, the last few times I went, I did not. I actually got them from the movie theater. But when I was younger, I used to always go to the dollar store first. To be fair, that was like high school. We would always drop by the, uh, <laughs> the, oh goodness I just remembered something I did which is kind of weird but okay um, I once hid gummy bears like in my pants like right <laughs> like in the crotch area yeah. so like if someone checked me if they find the gummy bears that's fucked up because they, they looked right there <laughs> <laughs> how old were you when you did this? Uh, like 16 <laughs> okay. giant bald in your pants and like <laughs> It's not going to say anything. I don't get paid <laughs> enough to do this. Um, I still go to the dollar store for the movie theater prices. Exactly. See, Lena gets it. Because <laughs> it's like, all right, I can get this exact same box of Swedish fish at the movie theater for like five bucks, or I can get it here for a dollar. Wow. <laughs> no, like our friend group started doing dinner before a movie. That's like actually really started. smart. Like we go and get like a couple of beer, and if you if you just want snacks, we just get like pretzels or whatever from like 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 the baked pretzels from the um, cross, and then or if you want a real food or whatever, we just get it there. And because it's right across the movie theater, it's literally like five five feet away. There's also the, door into the next one movie theater that I go to 
that the doll store is right next to her. Oh, okay. oh that's perfect. <laughs> so I'm not like going out of my way. Yeah. It, it, they, I think, like, they had to have done that a purpose, right? Like, there's no way that they put a dollar store right next to the movie theater and didn't expect people to be sneaking in candy. Yeah, they have to. Because, like, also, it's also also really nice if you go with someone who has a, a like a purse, because that's when you can start like sneaking in like the bigger cans and like Arnold Palmer's and yeah. shit. Like, <laughs> Hell, yeah. See, I've walked into a movie theater before with just in my hands like they don't say anything like they really don't care they do it a lot of them they do see, for the so. movie theaters that i go to they do they are oh. very sticklers about like oh. yeah. i think though it's the person who is at the the seat like you know what i mean like whoever's standing like uh to check your ticket because like if mm. they're like a person that's like oh bro i make minimum wage just go the fuck in i'm not going to stop you from eating your your cheesesteak um <laughs> Yeah. Like, I think my friends and I will go and just pick up in. food oh. and bring it in, and like just bring in like boxes of food with us, and they don't give a shit. <laughs> wow. White What's female privilege. Like? Oh, uh, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably also just the fact that they make probably twelve dollars an hour, and they're like, I don't get paid enough to care about this bullshit. Mm. Yeah, we would always get yelled at. <laughs> Yeah, but um, yeah. For me, I um, yeah, I always have to sneak. Always sneak. That's just fun. Fun to sneak. You feel like you're doing something wrong, but you're not. <laughs> also, you know what was weird? The movie theater near me was on Uber Eats. It's Wait. like, hey, you want a twenty dollar popcorn for? No. <laughs> <laughs> No, I do not. Do you want to <laughs> markup on your marked up shitty food? <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> what? No, no, I fucking don't. <laughs> you literally couldn't find the worst food in the world, and it's just like, but we are on the app now. <laughs> <laughs> but we're here. Give us your money. Yep. Are any of you guys uh, John Mulaney fans? Uh, no. I like his stuff, but I've never like watched a full special from him. Okay, because uh, like, I don't go out of my way. I like his stuff, but like, uh, like he took such a weird turn. Like, uh, not his comedy, but like as a person, it's like he divorced his wife and then like got like was it Olivia Munn pregnant? Who was it? Yeah, and they, I'm pretty sure they just broke up. <laughs> I think I yeah, heard they that did. today. Yeah, yeah. actually. <laughs> so it's funny that you bring him up. Yeah, that's, yeah, I, it's because of what I just said, it was, like, I tried, I said that, like, in, uh, he's having baby, he announces he's having, uh, baby. Um. Because I knew Olivia Munn from dating, like, Aaron Rodgers, the uh, Green Bay Packers quarterback. I remember hearing about him being with Olivia Munn because somebody was, huh? like, somebody was doing this crazy-ass, like, fucking serial killer using the yarn to, like, connect the pictures of him, like, getting back at that football player because he was from, like, whatever state was rivaled with that team. <laughs> oh my god, he's from Chicago. He's... <laughs> he's... That's where the Chicago Bears are. <laughs> All I heard was Olivia Munn. Yeah, she's involved. Okay. She's pregnant with John Mulaney's kid. That's unfortunate. Yeah, you said it. I'm a attack of the show. So they met, they broke up. Okay. They literally broke up today. <laughs> yeah. While she's pregnant? Yeah. Yep. Gross. Uh huh. They announced a baby. Huh. 
What a weird world we live in. I feel yeah. like... Because you just... I don't know. I don't know how to say that nicely. You just, like, look at... I'm just going to say it. You look at, like, Olivia Munn, you look at John Mulaney. And, like, I know John Mulaney is very funny. But, like... Yeah, I don't get how women are attracted to him. <laughs> <laughs> I I must be missing something. Uh, it's not... I'm not trying to be mean. Yeah. It's just I don't... Maybe it's because I'm a dude, and I don't get it. I mean, but, like, look at Ryan Reynolds. Maybe I, get, I get why people are attracted to Ryan I, Reynolds. I don't really get Ryan either. I do. Oh, I, I, get, I get Ryan Whoa. Reynolds. I, I sure do. <laughs> wow, dude, you're just racist against Canadians. I'm, you know it is. I love yeah. Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> I do, I, the worst part is, like, I got onto TikTok in, like, the peak of, oh my god, Ryan Reynolds. So uh, it was just, like, fucking constantly swiping through, like, video upon video of just people being like, oh my god, Ryan Reynolds. I've, I've been on the Ryan Reynolds bandwagon for a long time. See, I still haven't gone on TikTok. <laughs> Nor I have I TikTok ever. now. And therefore, okay. Oh, Tony? <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, you can send me TikToks if you want. Perfect. As, uh... <laughs> I, I don't know. I think John Mulaney, like, he's not unattractive, but he's no Ryan Reynolds. I mean, like, look at Ryan Reynolds. Like, <laughs> <laughs> sorry i just want you to look at ryan reynolds uh, where is this conversation <laughs> i don't know i lost track i'm looking at ryan reynolds but what about kevin Pereira? okay Oop. but ryan reynolds attack of the show <laughs> oh that's why yeah. but have you seen ryan reynolds too, recently or yeah not actually recently. i watched that 2021 movie that he's in that he's an NPC. Free guy. Free guy. Yeah. yeah. That I, also in it. I actually really want to see it. I was it good? It was yeah. all right. It okay. wasn't. I mean, it didn't make me angry. Yeah, it, it made me bad. a little angry because they kept breaking up the pacing of the movie to did, fucking yeah. just put in streamers and YouTubers and shit. Why but... did you hate on Jacksepticeye and Pokemon? <laughs> Wait, Jacksepticeye and Pokemon were in it? Yeah, yeah. Ninja. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ninja, I, okay. I can understand why you'd be angry at the Ninja edition, to be fair. Correct. But, He's um, completely irrelevant now, but... They just, they they kept pausing the movie so that they could be like, look who we have! Yeah. It's like, fuck, dude, I just want to watch the movie. Well, they, they had to talk about, like, the outside part of it, right? That the game's doing something. Uh-huh. <laughs> Is that what you're going with? I don't know. <laughs> Is this your final answer? I'm just happy that if they were going to do that at all, that they actually used real streamers. Oh, that's actually fair. Never mind. I just Enjoy wish your day. that they didn't do it in general. That's fair. <laughs> but I'm happy that like because they did, they used real ones. If that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Like they put in like literal nobodies. I didn't know who half the people were that they had in there. They might have been fake. I'm not really sure, but I don't remember any of them. I was watching it with my glasses on. So, <laughs> <laughs> how did you know that the people were them then? You hear them. That was fucking hard, yeah. <laughs> I can make out the general outline of Pokemon on my 16-inch TV. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I, I know what her outline's like. Okay. You know? <laughs> Fair. You know what I mean. <laughs> I don't particularly see faces of my glasses, but... Oh. People are made of shapes, you know? Wait, so... Did you purposely not wear your glasses? I was trying to go to sleep. Oh, uh, okay. It might have been, like, noon on a weekday. Yeah. Well, that's when you sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I should have already been asleep. Uh, but yeah. I think that's when I started watching the movie. You mm. know what I mean? 
Yeah. I was trying to give you excuses to okay. make it sound good. <laughs> no, I shouldn't have been awake at all. I, I was trying. I was throwing you a layup, and you just looked at the ball like, "What the fuck is that thing flying by?" <laughs> <laughs> I, I just should have been asleep already. <laughs> Oh god, what the, what did he just throw at me? I'm gonna move I'm gonna move to the side. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so I'm ordering hers potato chips now. Not as hungry. Tony, I just ate dinner like two hours ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just ate right before the podcast started. What's it's <laughs> Yeah, I ate like six. I'm not hungry. I just doing this for the for future, for future it's Tony. Probably a good thing that you're not hungry because if you were hungry, you'd probably I'd order twice as many. Yeah. yeah. Or even worse, you'd buy the wild chips. Oh yeah. <laughs> I didn't buy the wild chips. Yeah, I I bought um. I mean, if I get five more subs, will you buy the wild chips? <laughs> yes. Taking it Come on, that pays for itself. <laughs> He has to say, it actually it pretty much pays for it, so I would do it. Fuck. Oh, he did it. Okay. Oh, well, I have to do it now. <laughs> what a snow. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm buying... I'm just going to have so many people. Like, why did you buy all these chips? I'm like, well, one of them, I... Well, thank you, of course, Kyle, for the five gift, and I'll let you know how they are. Thank you. Why are you buying so many chips? I don't know! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who any of these people are. Uh, we have... Oh, and Dorsey. And Dorsey. Yeah. I don't know who the other ones are, to be completely fair. Um, but in Dorsey, yeah, you know who in Dorsey. In Dorsey is a long-time friend of the channel who I believe lives in Sweden. So a lot of the times, uh, it's going to be harder for them to be there. around. Um, I love the fish from there. That's a good point. <laughs> We're just talking about how we love their fish delicacy called Swedish fish, which is, which is a candy. Um. <laughs> uh, well, you had them at our wedding. <laughs> did you actually? Oh, well, you did, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm sorry, I meant like, and you ate them at the wedding. Oh, no, no, like, they were part of like, the, like, because it, it was a hit and run wedding, you know what I mean? Like, uh, mm. this is all like mid COVID. This is like, just, like the backyard. Everyone wears masks. Ceremony done. Like, there's 30 people, including her family. You Where know. were the Swedish fish then? Uh, she gave them to us in like a gift bag as we left. <laughs> uh, oh, so okay, so you got Swedish fish. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I wish I could have gone for the Swedish fish. Right, worth it. Have you, have you ever had the like assorted flavors of Swedish fish? I actually like, just before? had that yesterday. <laughs> what did you think of them? I liked it. Really? Yeah, I was I was confused by a few of the flavors at first, but. Yeah. Yeah. I I don't know. I feel like in the variety pack there's like two flavors that I'll eat and then the other ones no. But the original is just so good. I used to like Skittles a lot and then they made green from lime to apple and I was just pissed. Oh, oh I do remember you being very upset about that. By, upset about by that. talking about it, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still upset about it. <laughs> hmm. I'm like, hell yeah, Skittles, and then it's just like... Ray is obviously colors. not for apples, guys. Green is for lime. I it's felt that lime. on a spiritual level, Kyle. Oh, Chroma also. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I always hit the yellow and green ones last because they're my favorite. Like uh, I've said before... Skittles is a magical journey for me. <laughs> <laughs> and then it just got worse because they added apple instead of lime. <laughs> well, I never, I never knew that the uh, the lime was coming, so I can't be disappointed not knowing. Say, not you know what I mean? No. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it just they just forgot them. <laughs> Fifth Aroni. Fair. What are you up to, Marlon? <laughs> Have you found your son? Nemo. Being a good Nemo. <laughs> I literally just made that connection. What the hell? I always ask, uh, oh, you have. Oh. Where is, where is he? Hmm. 
Where is he? T tell us where he is. Oh, let's fuck up. Where is he? <laughs> what did you do to Nemo? <laughs> Why did you say I found him and you're not giving us any more details about it? Marvin? Marvin? What happened? What happened to him? What do you mean, yes? <laughs> Don't pull Tony. <laughs> Where is he? This is an end or. <laughs> This is, this is where the fuck is it? That's game. That's the champion end war. Where you combine them. Tony mode intensifies. Oh yeah, what um, what's your favorite movie theater snack? That is our question of the week. The week of the question. I do that every week. I just question. Why does this have to happen again? Chicken sandwich that we snuck in. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, let me let me out of like snack food. Let's 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 go there. Because it's fair. Sneaking in a chicken sandwich would be M and M's solid. Notice your belly is so fluffy. Oh, he's very mad at me for betting it right now. Oh wait, why? Is he in the printer? To, he's, he's pretending to be mad at me. No, oh. no, he's on my chest. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's just wagging his tail at me, <laughs> grumbling, but not moving. <laughs> oh, such a cute kitty. All right. Well, I've now ordered chips from two different places. Bug. So. <laughs> nice. One of them gives a lot more chips for a lot less, and the other one, um, I told Kyle I would do it if he gifted the subs for it. So. Yeah. <laughs> good to have a my word. chip that you know will be good. You know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I actually had this like. Oh, these suck. <laughs> And before Nathan was like, I didn't want to tell you this before you ordered it. But actually, I'm affiliated with it. Uh, so make sure you use code Nathan to check. <laughs> it's like, I already placed the order. Why did you say something beforehand? <laughs> use the conversations that appear in my head. Did anyone hear the Otis squeal? No. Mm -mm. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. No, okay, no <laughs> Why did he squeal? Oh, he was trying to get uppity with me, so I picked him up. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he was like, "Ah, oh, fuck!" <laughs> oh no, Kyle, this is what I wanted at all. <laughs> so I always have like my, I like, have my left hand like on the back of his like hip, um, and he's like on his back, right? Hmm. He's like pawing and like biting at my hand, and he actually like bit. So I kind of picked him up by his, <laughs> by his hip. <laughs> <laughs> You don't actually bite me, kitty. You know better than that. So, because I put it in Discord, but um, if you guys are ever curious to what my mind is like while playing Valorant, this is a very good representation. Is this the one from last night? Yeah. <laughs> 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 I have all my fingers and I've got stuff. It's a nice song. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> then I turned it into being afraid. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put well, it in Twitch. I wonder chat. if this is like a just like me and you age thing? Because Kyle didn't know the nice song. No. No. Nathan, do it. you know the nice song? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. So Kyle's is. Um, Zoomers. Kyle's to. <laughs> Um, uh, experience in life. Oh, yeah. <laughs> people, people in like middle school would do it with pencils. Yeah, yeah, we did. Or pens. I mean, I know the thing. Or butter just, knives. It wasn't a song. I like the song though. The song's so good. My favorite thing was like. You watch, like, uh, someone do, like, the guy who, like, came up with the knife song, like, do it. Oh, he does it perfect. 
and then you watch a video of like a guy who messes up the knife song while doing it and like he lifts his hands up and he cut the shit out of his hands <laughs> it's like, oh oh no that's great that's so good <laughs> yeah that's a fluffy boy oh Sorry. oh this is a fluffy baby be free yeah, there was a part of me that was really expecting to hear like a BAM! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I don't know if <laughs> no, what if you wouldn't hear the BAM? I was gonna throw him on the couch. <laughs> I know too far away, so I didn't throw him. Yeah, I know you don't actually like abuse no. Kitty. Um, only but it mildly. Is, yeah. Only mildly. <laughs> Yeah, oh, and he usually likes it, I think. That's exactly. It's to his benefit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Like force belly rubs. Mm -hmm. Get over here. I'm rubbing your belly. <laughs> like he's almost about to jump back up again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Doesn't actually hate it. <laughs> yeah. God, Lucy is so sassy. My dog Lucy just doesn't stop sassing. <laughs> like, um, so she, a few things about her, I think I've talked about at least one of them. She's a klepto. Oh. S steal oh. everything. She'll just steal. Before huh. we got her, we knew she was a potato thief. Oh, okay. yeah. The potato thief. <laughs> yeah. <Yep. laughs> so at her previous uh, house, she, they had potatoes in like a cupboard and uh, <sighs> Lucy would just go in and take a potato. And she didn't eat it. She just kept the potato. It was hers now. <laughs> I don't want that dog. Yeah, that's Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, I'm like, this dog's perfect. <laughs> Please never change. Um, she also will bark if, and if my dad, my brother, or myself sneeze. Not my mom. <laughs> I feel like in general guys have much louder sneezes though, so maybe it's just the mine isn't that loud though. Huh. Like interesting. Um, comparably, like to like my dad or my brother, I have a lot like lighter of a sneeze. Um, but yeah, my the other ones, yeah. But maybe it just resonates with her, and she's she's like, I must scream. I do like these dog emotes. Keep them coming. <laughs> hey, wait, which one's Lucy though? She's the smaller one. The what? She's my smaller dog. I think I need snaps. Yeah, I will send you a pic. I can only remember Cash. Yeah, Cash Cash is because we've had him a lot longer. Yeah. Um, give me but a moment. I will find the Lulu. She's very cute. I love her. Who's that? Oh, that's Cash in a Cone. Aww. Such a sad boy. Oh, that's a really cute trap inch. I can't keep getting distracted by going through my pictures. That's Salem. I have a picture of Salem saved. <laughs> Why wouldn't you have a picture yeah, of Salem true. saved? I think this is just a funny one for perspective. She's the little one in the back. She's the one in the middle. Oh. The one on the left. <laughs> the tiny. <laughs> yeah, she's so li so like I. Uh, for anyone um, who's curious, my two dogs are both Shetland sheepdogs, and Cash is towards the biggest end that they get. Lucy is at the tiniest end that they can. <laughs> um. Wait, that's like last winter, right? Yes. <laughs> this is done for you yet, is it? Yeah, no, that was that was last. These are the more, most recent pictures I have of her, because, um, yeah, she just. Was she a cutie? She's cutie, but um, I take more pictures of uh. Cash, because he lays in my bed. Hold on, do I have that couch? <laughs> hey, give me a second. I'm taking a picture of the couch. It's literally behind me. <laughs> that's that, how? That'd be kind of very. That'd be very funny if. Uh, you know.
that'd be very funny if Kyle comes back and is like, yeah, actually, I have that exact couch. Um, exact same couch. <laughs> actually, I used to have that couch. It went missing. <laughs> Tony, did you steal my couch? Uh, all right, that's been it for back. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is a shit see emote. That's a good Shih Tzu emote. I like the Shih Tzu. I love Shih Tzus. Yeah. Tiny babies. Well, actually, Bear and Lucy weigh, I think, like, pretty much the same thing, right? Yeah, they're, they're really similar in weight, which is It's so very funny similar, to me. Kyle. Very similar. Different pa different material, though. Okay, so you picture the love seat. I have yeah. the matching cow tray beside it. Hmm. It, um... It looks similar. It's it's similar, but like the material is different. Like the the feel of the material would be different. Like even the material looks close. <laughs> like yeah, look close. it's it's very close. So uh, very close. Yeah, no, very similar couch. <laughs> yeah, um, but because Kyle, I don't know if you heard it, but um, just for perspective, Bear and Lucy weigh the same. What? Yeah. Yeah. I think Lucy might be a pound or two more than Bear, but they're pretty How much, much is the Bear same. weigh? Uh last time I weighed him he was nineteen. Okay, so sorry, Lucy weighs twenty one. So there is two pounds difference. But if uh Bear goes to Pi's parents' house, they weigh the same. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he always comes back weighing at least a pound more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so they're similar. Like so but like I think Lucy I don't know if like Lucy would be like a lot taller though. Because I think uh, probably. Shih Tzus are more like stocky, right? Uh, like they're, they're little Yeah, he... little short, thicker babies. I should measure him, like how tall he is. He's not very tall. Like when he stands on his back legs and puts his paws up on me, they go barely over my knees. Like how tall mid, are you? Mid thigh range. I'm five eight. Five eight. Okay. I'm just trying to picture like, just a few more inches. <laughs> yeah, because like, like his top paws, like when he goes on his back legs, can like reach above my knee. But yeah, he's yeah. literally the size of Otis. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah. How much? How is? Uh, how much does Otis weigh? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it was <laughs> long. I just he like to think that Kyle picks cat. up Otis and like moves him around. He weighs the size of a baby. He puts him down. <laughs> 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 he weighs baby. <laughs> I like when I when I do the feeding of him. I'm like, oh, that's about ten pounds. <laughs> yeah. Feed him according to that. <laughs> Lifts him up and just like shakes him. How much do you weigh? <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, yeah, because cat between like seven and twelve. I don't know. Okay, because cats are so hard for me to ever know how much they weigh. Right. Is Otis a small cat? I mean, he's fairly small. Okay, like for cats, like you see a small one. I, I feel like I've seen some big cats. Yeah, like I, I, like most cats that I see are bigger. Why is he so tiny? Little baby. He's a little baby. Is he? He's not grown anymore, though, is he? I don't think so. He's two. Yeah. <laughs> he's not growing. He's just a little guy. Unless he grows outwards, and I don't want him to get fat. So. Oh, he could get rounder. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's the thing with like cats, because I feel like I've met a lot of cats that are longer than Bear, but he's just more built. Mm. You know. He's stocky. Yeah. Oh, like Otis can stretch for sure. Like that motherfucker will take out my bed if he wants to. <laughs> it's like, how did you get so long? <laughs> I've actually done that before. I'm like, how? How do you do this? <laughs> Where do you hide this? <laughs> yeah. I, I, there's this thing with me, at least in like my dogs and other people's dogs and cats too. Like they'll like look so small in like a certain pose, and then sometimes they look so big. It's like, how do you like? Make yourself look so tiny. Yeah. And then, like, now you're the size of a, a twin bed. Uh, how'd that happen? <laughs> like, he can stretch, like, the length of my leg. That's oh, big. Where, does, where is he hiding all that normally? I don't know. But, like, like from the tip of his toes, like, if he, like, wants to, like, flatten right out, he can do that. That's great. Wow, that's a long <laughs> cat. They're, like, putty. They just, like, yeah. stretch. Oh, like so it's like uh, that dog you were talking about, where it's a no bones. 
Oh, noodles. Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> there's a there's a dog on TikTok. Actually, uh, they got on they got on the Today Show on my birthday actually. And uh it's this 13-year-old pug and his name is Noodles. Ugh. And every morning the owner like picks him up and sees if he'll support his own weight on his legs or if he'll just fall back down to the side and sleep. Oh, I've seen that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Bones or no bones. Yeah, bones or no bones, yeah. His name is Noodles. He is cute. It's <laughs> watching a few of them right now. Yeah, today wait, what was today? Today was a bones day, funny enough. Oh, that means, so... like, magical shit's supposed to happen. Yeah, pretty yeah. much. Because a 13-year-old pug in who knows where decided that it was going to have bones. This <laughs> 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 is a picture of him in a suitcase. In a suitcase, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching, um, like, uh... A quick uh, clip from the Today Show, and they showed a picture of noodles in a suitcase. Oh, oh, oh is he gonna fall? Oh, oh no, that's a bones day. Oh, oh, it's just a potato. He's literally so cute. <laughs> that dog is a potato, and it's adorable, and I love it. Animals or potatoes is just so cute. It's like, oh, you're a potato. You're just a potato with legs. Adorable. I love it. Exactly. I mean, I'm a potato with legs, and people don't call me cute, but you know. <laughs> it's okay. Um, but cute. Very cute. Such a good... Kyle, why don't you like pugs? They're ugly. Oh. Tony's the cutest potato? Thank you. Thank you, Marlon. <laughs> Um, why why are they ugly, Kyle? Their noses and their faces. You don't like them faces being squished? No. Is that why you don't like Bear? Because his face is all squished? Correct. Uh, you don't like Bear? <laughs> he hates Bear. How could you hate Bear? I don't like Shih Tzu's. That's so, he's so cute, though. Not even the bugs. They're just what? rats. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> they rats. They're not... Where where is your bad. cutoff for a dog then? <laughs> um, it has to have it has to have the nose. So are my dogs nose. dogs. Yeah. Okay. Your dog your dog's a dog. Okay. Both of them. <laughs> Both of them. Okay. And my dog's a rat. Your yeah. dog is a dog. Okay. No, thank you. <laughs> Would so all Nathan's dogs are dogs? I believe so. Yeah. Yeah. Because all of them have long snoots. Uh huh. Uh huh. You need the snoot to boop, you know? They do. They have some long-ass snoots. And they know <laughs> how to fucking utilize them. <laughs> <laughs> they pokers. They're pokers. They're, they'll get under your arm and flip it up. Oh. Whatever whatever that's called. They're, they're flippers. <laughs> Why are you consoling your house rat? Yeah. They called him a house rat. <laughs> No, the funny thing is, you could call him a house rat, and he would still be okay with it because he loves everyone. Oh my god, he's the most loving dog. <laughs> he's so cute. You could literally, like, I'm not saying you should, but you could hunt Flippers. him across the field <laughs> and come back for pets. Trust me, I've done that. Well, don't. <laughs> but if you did, he would still come back for attention and love. Oh, I don't feel that'd be sad. Is that called Stockholm syndrome? Is that what that's called? Uh, yeah, probably. Okay. I mean, I think Otis is the same way with me. But yeah. Stockholm. Yeah. All he knows is Yeah. <laughs> He's starting to warm up to my brother and dad now more. Aw. But. Yeah. That's good. I can't get over baby. that, Nathan. You said the dogs are flippers. <laughs> They're flippers, man. <laughs> Like spatulas, they just toss you up in the air. Yeah. They do, that's exactly what they do. <laughs> Hell yeah. They're like, oh, an unsuspecting arm resting <laughs> ever so carefully <laughs> on the, the fucking armrest of the couch. 
<laughs> Flip. <laughs> Not anymore. It's on top of my nose, buddy. <laughs> now boop my snoot, please. <laughs> And when I say please, I mean you boot my snoot. <laughs> oh. Nathan has such an awesome array of like mix of dogs though too. Like I love the mixes. Not that I don't love the purebreds, of course, too. Well, purebred. Right? No, Ma is Max is a full shepherd, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, man, and Roxy. Roxy is a uh, border collie. Then you have a hap. Border Collie, Half German Shepherd. Yep, on accident. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's yeah. great, though. We love him. <laughs> Two reds and then an accidental mutt. <laughs> Wasn't our goal. He's <laughs> here 50 50. <laughs> we love uh, him. We, we love him nonetheless. That's Dante, right? <laughs> yep. Yeah. And then Ivan the Terrible. Yep. Is uh, he's half lab after German Shepherd? Yep. Oh, those are adorable. Those are adorable. Yeah, I had uh, my grand granny had a half lab half German Shepherd called Sammy. Oh. I think I have a picture for somewhere actually. I love those. Uh, I don't know why I have never sent that to Nathan. Let me find it. I have it somewhere. Um, here she is. She was older in this photo though, and she was she was a she was a big gal. So. Yes, I am taking a photo of a photo to send it to you guys. Woo! <laughs> See, like, I think, I want, it's so interesting, though, how, like, dogs can, um, like, could be, like, a mixed bread of the same thing, but probably look a lot different. Because that's Sammy. Um, apparently, when she was a puppy, she was, like, all black. And then that dark spot on her back, that was where she, <laughs> they'd all move. Like, so like, yeah, she got bigger. Yeah, that was Sammy. She was the best. We fable her as, like, the the best dog that, like, anyone has had. Because, wow. like, she was half lab, half German Shepherd. She's pretty. Yeah. And she had puppies that, um, it was before I was born. But um, she had puppies with a husky. Oh. So it w they were like what half husky, half lab slash German Shepherd, and like the picture. I don't have any here, but the pictures of them are so cute. They were pup. They were just adorable. That's, that's crazy how much of a German Shepherd she looks like, like mm, coloring yeah. wise at least. Yeah, she came in like shepherd. Or coloring like. Shepherd face looks like a lab to me, like so much. We uh we thought. Ivan was going to look like a German Shepherd when he was real little. Mm. And then he got real big and he doesn't look like a German Shepherd. That's what they said for same with uh, Sammy is that she looked like she had the coloring of a Shepherd, but like as a baby, she looked like a German Shepherd puppy pretty much. That was but. the other thing was Ivan's all black. Oh. And uh, he's like He's got, like, some weird-ass brown undercoat that shines through sometimes. <laughs> I thought it, he was just, like, getting dirt on himself at first. <laughs> he, he goes out there, and he rolls around, and he plays with the sticks and everything. <laughs> but only one of our dogs that actually plays with sticks. But, um... Yeah, we thought that we were just gonna have, like, a full black German Shepherd. And then... He's got these huge ass floppy ears. <laughs> yeah. That didn't turn out very German Shepherd at all. <laughs> oh man, that's so cute. <laughs> um, we also like my brother and I at least fable Sammy as like the protector because if we were by like in the same house as Sammy and we got yelled at, she wouldn't put up with it. She wouldn't let my mom yell at us. Good. Like, you yell, if she would yell at us, and then Sammy would come in between and, like, bark at my mom. <laughs> she was like, no, they're, they're my babies now. Because, <laughs> unfortunately, Sammy, like, uh, passed away when I was, like, probably in, like, kindergarten or something. So I don't have, like, the longest memories of her. But, like, from what I remember, she was the best. 
you know, like, when you're little, you think dogs are, like, bigger. They had a dog called Lizzie at the same time, which is funny because we have a friend called Lizzie now. Um, I just made that connection. And Zell's in chat! Zell Peak, I am basic popcorn good. Great shout, Zell. Um, Lizzie was, like, a, a normal, like, poodle dog. Um, and I thought she was a big dog, but she was probably, like, Lucy size. But I was so little that I'm like, this is a big dog. Because <laughs> I'm tiny. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Did you guys ever have that? Like, where like you would see a pet and, like, you would learn later on that, like, you, it's not nearly as big as you thought it was? Yeah. Because my, my aunt always had really big dogs. And she had a, uh, a St. Bernard, which yeah. are big dogs. But, yeah. like... When I was little, I was like, this is dog is the size That's of a bear. building. Yeah. Oh my god, it's going to crush me. Uh, and then as I got older, I was like, oh, he's just a fluffy love bug. <laughs> but like when I was a kid, I was terrified that he was going to like stomp on me and crush yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be crushed by a thousand pounds of fluff. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. He was so cute. For sure. <laughs> um... Yeah, I just realized we have a friend, Lizzie, and that dog is called Lizzie. That's funny. It's a teehee. Um, Zell, how do you like your popcorn, though? Is there a specific way? Because some people were saying they like salty popcorn uh, and don't like sweet popcorn. Some people like sweet popcorn. Pie likes this marshmallow popcorn thing. It sounds pretty salted good. Salted and buttered. Salted and buttered. Buttered and salted. Does the salt go on first, or is, it, or is butter going first? Salt. Butter? What? Oh no! I didn't. I, didn't, I really. That, that way you can shake it all the way through. But then the butter makes it the salt stick better to the popcorn, right? Accurate, but then it'll stick all like mostly on the top, right? Um, I want the salt all the way through. You can shake it all the way through if you salt it first. I didn't okay. know people thought about this. I was just. Uh... But your top layer would be better, yes. Yeah, I, I yeah. was going to say, so, yeah, savory slash diabetes friendly popcorn. Yeah, so you're probably not like a um, oh, very fair. sweet. Um, yeah. Welcome back to the printer, Otis. Oh. He lives there. And yes, yeah, salt first for better distribution. Zell agrees. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, I feel like I, I never finish a bag of popcorn, so maybe that's why I do it that way, is because I only really eat the stuff on top and maybe, like, halfway down, and then I don't eat the rest, so what I don't do need do it to fully rest? distribute. Uh, you throw it, it out? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning again! There's Ashley back! Hi, Ashley! Good morning! Good morning again. You've made it through. Congratulations, you passed the first squid. Oh my god, is that Otis? Oh. oh he's so cute. He always does look surprised, though. <laughs> <laughs> Sheldon's <mean>? right. <laughs> I don't know, it's just like the way, like his little dark thing like under his chin, or where his, his chin is. Yeah, his little goatee. Like, if he ever looks up, he just looks surprised. <laughs> <laughs> he's so cute. I just like the way that his front paws are, like, hanging off the edge of it. Yeah. Oh, today he was, like, sleeping off my bed. It was so fucking weird. Like, literally his head and his front, like, shoulders were, like, off the corner of the, like, the bottom of my bed. And the rest of him was just, like, like lengthened out. <laughs> That's such a nice tail. Look how floofy his tail is. Gotta get the medium hairs, man. Oh, he's so cute. Long hair cats, too long, too short. Okay. I'm about to take I'm another painkiller and go to sleep, even though I had a lot of painkillers. Six times 400 milligram ibuprofen and three times 20 drops of tramadol. I don't know if I know what tramadol is. Smile. That's, That's a um... lot. Is it like a mitol kind of thing? I don't, I don't know what tramadol is, actually. I might be pronouncing wrong uh, as well. A TR... A M A D O L. Yeah, I thought it was like a. Um, how do I put this? Might be wrong. It's, an, uh, it's a narcotic use to mod treat severe pain. Morphine like painkiller. Oh. Okay. It's an opioid. Uh, okay, gotcha. 
I thought it was like a woman thing. That's my doll, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. As I said, it's like yeah. my doll. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it does end in uh, doll. DOL. Yeah. Yeah, same thing. <laughs> yeah, that's a, yeah, that's great, Kyle. Someone asks you for my doll, you give them fucking Trump doll. <laughs> <laughs> you give them opioids. Yeah. The <laughs> I knew Straight what you were really morphine. asking for. <laughs> Kyle would be fired as a doctor immediately. <laughs> I feel like I'd be very popular though. Uh, for the time you're there, yes. yeah, you would be. <laughs> for the like the day and a half short, you're short able to get out there, um, I had it uh, when I had my ribs broken. I didn't know you had your ribs broken. That sounds horrifying. I'm sorry, friendo. It was um, a while ago it, it that helped. you had that. But now I have a lot to keep the pain away. Kind of high on meds, lol. Yeah, I was going to say, that does seem like a decent amount of um, stuff, so hopefully the pain is gone. I'm not a doctor, though. I think Reese is, is a lawyer. I was. True. Yep, yeah, I'm totally a doctor. That's, that's how I get away with not going to them. <laughs> that makes so much sense. No, it doesn't. <laughs> you would know why you can't see after you eat. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, my diagnosis is it's probably fine. <laughs> <You're> correct. <laughs> the pain is gone, but it's coming back. Oh, well, at least I hope it's enough for you to be able to get to sleep. Have a nice sleepy time with a with a nice alpaca or a llama. A llama. A llama. That actually has nice llamas. Yes. That's very true. I'll admit it. That's a nice llama. <laughs> I'm not... I'm man enough to say it. <laughs> That's why I have to take another painkiller to go to sleep. Hello? Ah, oh, fair. Gotcha. Why are we talking about my llamas? Because I think your llamas are adorable. That actually is the only reason why I mentioned it. <laughs> they are, yeah. Yeah. Well, I was saying that for when you go to uh, sleep, you have an adorable little llama. Is it pain in your face? She was saying that her face is like swollen. A bear as well? How the hell did he get to Europe? I, I don't know how he got there. <laughs> That's a, t turned around. He's back. What? The, I stole it. You stole bear? Uh, no. <laughs> Pie bear check. <laughs> yeah. He was just sitting on my lap, literally five seconds ago. Where'd he go? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's on the staring at me. Okay. okay. Yeah. Unless this is a clone, I don't know. I don't know. What if Maybe Ashley has a clone? Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh oh. Okay. I say Snuff sense. wants to steal him too, so maybe I should just make a few clones of him. I'll just take ship one. him. Oh, okay, cool. I do want to meet the real bear, though. He is a love bug. Uh huh. I, I would love bear you, so much. Don't judge him. You've never met him, Kyle. <laughs> I would love him. Thank you, Tony. I love. Uh, I love uh, Cody Ryan's uh, Shih Tzu. I want it. Oh my god, Cody is so, so cute. fucking cute. Yeah, he's, he's just a little old, man, old man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I I met him when he was a lot younger. Cause how long I've known Ryan. <laughs> um, yeah, cause I've known Ryan at least. I met Ryan like my sophomore year of high school, I think. And I'm old now, <laughs> so that's Same. a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say if my if my first dog was still alive, she would be probably about the same age as Cody. Oh, Ashley said, if you're old, I'm old. Ashley, I didn't want to tell you. <laughs> well, actually, because I think we... Um, we're going over it, and uh, Ashley is exactly eight days older than I am. Yeah, I was going to say, she was born the same year as you. Yeah, same year, same month. Yeah. Did you feel old, though, not going to lie? Like, honestly, Ashley, like, I feel old a lot now. <laughs> 
like there are just certain things you do and you're like oh, man, like i don't remember bending down to pick things up like this bugging me as much as it used to <laughs> oh, i haven't hit that point yet oh no hey. oh no tony asked pie if she remembers my b-day date pie uh-huh do you remember what day ashley was born um i do remember what day ashley was born it was january 9th that's correct yeah yeah because she is exactly eight days. So you were exactly eight days. Year, <laughs> Tony, eight days older. I almost said eight day year older. What? That's not <laughs> work, Tony. That's not how days work. <laughs> I because hers is it, the yeah. ninth, yours is the seventeenth, and then Wakia's is the twenty fourth. Wakia's in January oh, too. Yeah. Wait a second. The twenty fourth. Twenty fourth. Wait yeah. a second. I know someone with that birthday. <laughs> <laughs> A certain man, <laughs> certain man right here. <laughs> well, there you go. We have an army, Nathan. Uh-huh. Yeah, Nathan's twenty fourth. How old is Wakia? Um, Wakia is nineteen. Okay, so she's like, okay, she's a little younger than Nathan then. Yep. Yeah. I thought it would even be funny, though, if, like, somehow... <laughs> yes. Wait, I mean, she's exactly a year younger. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, so... Man, why is, why are so many of our European friends so, so much baby? They're so young. Like, Snuff is, like, 18, right? Yeah, Snuff's 18, or, yeah, because his birthday's in November, so... Oh, so he'll be Oh, wait, soon. December, sorry, December. Okay. Um, so yeah, he'll be turning 19. Okay, and then Dave's not a baby, though. Probably doesn't know Dave, I don't think. <laughs> Nathan knows Dave. <laughs> uh, Ashley's routine three quacks. I remember a few times people were like, "Oh, so what soundboard do you use?" What? <laughs> what do you? What do you mean? Oh, um, thank you. <laughs> but um, it's like, I know I make I do that noise. That's me. <laughs> this is this is like my my talent. That and not seeing colors, but I don't know if that's a talent. That might just be like a setback. It depends on perspective. I'm the best at not seeing colors you've ever met. I bet. You. Can we have a not seeing color contest? Sure. I win. <laughs> Exclamation point gray chew. And I think it's EY. If that's the one you're looking for, Ash. Like, um. <laughs> I think it's this. There it is. <laughs> I hate to tell you this, but Pikachu's gray. Because, like, during. Yeah, I love that clip too. <laughs> Wakia and Ashley are talking about what color a certain part of Pikachu is. <laughs> He's gray. <great. laughs> I do my best to try to time things well when it comes to people talking about colors around me. That time, I think I did well. My good timing. I do love that clip too, Ash. It's a very good clip. Top tier clip. Clippity, clippity, clip, clip, clip. Yeah, Kyle. I agree. Slam that thing down. I don't. You just might have booed. I don't know. You made an exclamation point, Tony, in my chat. What is it linked to? Is it is it this clip? <laughs> That'd be really funny. <laughs> Yes, sir. <laughs> I love that. I love that so much. My legacy will live on. <laughs> Beautiful. That's so good. <laughs> I love that so much. I feel like um, most of the exclamation point names I have are warnings. Thank you, Ashley, for hosting a stream with one viewer. 
I uh, appreciate it. You weren't streaming before this, I know. So, <laughs> at least I don't think you were. But um, regardless, I appreciate it. Uh, she was not. Oh, Benj Pets. Wait a second. Oh, that's Ben. Is that Ben? Yeah. Is that our boy Ben? That's Benny boy. Ben. Hi, Ben. If you're here. Ben, hi, I, it's, nice, it's nice to see you, Ben. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Don't talk about me behind my back, Pi. <laughs> <laughs> what do <Send> you ben. <laughs> uh, Good morning, Ben. Yeah, like Ashley said, good morning. How are you, Ben? Ben, we have a question of the week, uh, actually. Um, what is your favorite movie theater snack? And thank you again so much for the follow, my man. And you... And Pi just gifted it to you one to Ben! Yay! Thank you, Pi! Yeah. He called me out, so... Oh, yeah. Show him that yeah. I'm not a terrible person. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. But I'm very curious what your go-to movie theater snack is, Ben. And if you never go to the movie theaters, I would say, what snack do you have, like, at home when you would watch a movie? I think is a fair uh, compromise. And if not, then that's just, I don't know. Difficult one. Interesting. Yeah, because, so, to give you, like, a little thought, uh, to maybe jog your brain, a lot of people's answers were, like, some sort of variant of popcorn. Um, mine is... Uh, See, like, I don't know, like, in other countries and stuff, uh, which candies, like, or where, but I like candies called Swedish Fish and Mike and Ike's. Um, I feel like those would be, like, international brands. Little Snack Pretzels, that's a good shout. Actually, uh, Lena had said pretzels earlier, I remember. That's a good shout. That's a great shout. So, Ben, I have a question about your username. Who are you petting? <laughs> that's, that's, that's a good question. I like an Ikes and know Swedish fish. What are they? They're a gummy fish, I feel like, would be the best way to describe them. That have, like, um... I don't know what flavor Swedish fish are. Like, the default I ones? I think they're uh, not pomegranate. What are they? What flavor is color flavoring? <laughs> <They're> red. <laughs> what flavor? Um, like, it's like Gatorade. You don't call them by the name. Yeah, call them by the color. It's uh, oh. it it's the flavor of lingonberry, a European berry. Oh. Um. I didn't know that they were lingonberry flavor. Pets is a shorter version of my oh. surname. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just thought that, uh, like, it was just, I don't know. I'm just like, Benj Pets? Who? <laughs> <laughs> who, is, who is he petting? Who are you petting? What are you petting? When are you petting? <laughs> um, <Why? yes. laughs> so, Swedish fish are like a gummy, um, a gummy fish that are, they can berry flavored. Sending him a picture of them right now. Okay, they're really good. I very much enjoy them. And Ash said, "Okay, Tony, it's time for me to go to bed and grab some other painkillers and go to bed. I'm tired. Have a great stream. Then good morning, Ashley. Because we Ashley always says good morning, even if it's good night time. So good morning, Pets equals Peter. See, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> good morning, Ash." <laughs> Yeah, we were actually just talking about they have a variety pack of them. They had them. I don't know what the other flavors were, though, Pi. Um, I'm pretty sure it's, like, orange, lime, uh... But shoot, where do you I put, can't remember the other one. Do you ones. put the lime in the coconut and mix it all up? No. Oh, never mind. Not Sorry. typically. Not with Swedish fish. I feel like that would be weird. Weird if you make it weird. Yeah, why did you have to make it so weird? <laughs> 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 I 
I'm really good at that. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's too good. Um, I'm trying to see if it's what it says. Swedish, Swedish, sweet. Oh, no. Nope. <laughs> it's just for fish to say Swedish on the front of it. That's not the flavors. <laughs> so. Huh. I can't find it. What? They exist. Why can't. Oh. What Swedish fish? Oh, they fish? have a mini. They have a mini tropical kind that came out. Bum, 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 Those bum, actually bum, look bum, interesting. Bum, bum, bum. There's a coconut mm. one. <laughs> um, but yeah, the other ones are orange, lime, lemon, and original. I'm pretty oh. sure. But good. Yeah. I'm buying Mike and Ike's. Um, you know, at least. Because Mike and Ike's are delicious. Love me some Mike and Ike's. I, it is always interesting because, like, I even know if there's differences. Like, for example, a pile is AFK for a minute, but um, between the U.S. and Canada for like candies, like there's a candies candy we have called Smarties. Smarties yeah. that are mm-hmm. like just like a sugar candy, right? Where it's just like a circle, like assorted flavor candy. Um, and in Canada, it's basically like a knockoff M M&M. and M. Um. But they have Smarties, but they call them Rockets. Like, they're actually, if you Googled Smarties and Rockets, they actually have, like, pictures of them next to each other, and it's just a different label. It's same font, same everything. Um, Jolly Ranchers are also a good choice. What's your favorite Jolly Rancher? Um, mine is Blue Raspberry. Which, let me tell you again, as a colorblind person, Blue Raspberry <laughs> confused the shit out of me. <laughs> 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 what do you wait a second <laughs> what do you mean raspberries aren't blue they're not blue why is it called blue raspberry <laughs> why are they doing this to me honestly well, even well, i don't know okay. why they're called blue raspberry i think wait, they're, they're just, it's just raspberries that are blue aren't they but like but they're yeah. like blue raspberries I don't, yeah i just i feel like i th- why think they, they did it, it to like um I think, like, someone said, yeah, so, like, they would be oh, different than, like, the red uh, berries, like, strawberries and cherries. So, like, they would look different. And thank you, Ben, for the hundred bits. Is that a dog? That's a dog. Oh, the ears. You guys see those ears? Oh, blue blue raspberries are not natural. Very yeah. good. Yeah, I was saying, I'm just looking into it. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm pretty oh, sure, unless, like, I this conversation that I've had is a multi-tiered lie to confuse me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> to me, they look more purple than blue. Blue but then again, Yeah. Oh, this is, this is, this is too much for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, since I... Yeah, raspberries are red. ...been conscious, people have been fighting over what's blue and what's purple true like blueberries but i me, I, I will agree purple. like some some of these pictures they the raspberry the blue raspberries do look very purple they're kind of like a darker tone but then there are also some where they look like they're fucking leds and they're bright blue yeah i've been seeing a lot of those ones too because like i know again i'm a colorblind, blind but aren't like purple is like a grape right like grape flavor is yes yes but yeah. grapes can also be green. <laughs> I forgot the grapes can be green, too. <laughs> yeah, there's green grapes. I actually had actually, green grapes recently, I think. Have you ever heard of those um, cotton candy grapes? No. So they're... My little like, sister loved those. I've never had them. Cotton I've seen them, but I've never grapes? bought them. Yeah, they're like actual green grapes, but they taste like cotton candy, apparently. I have not tried them. I... I, I'm then I'm with you here. That does just sound so wrong. I like, want to try co- them. Like I okay. So to be honest, if you put it in front of me and said this grape tastes like cotton candy, it, I would have eaten it very fast. <laughs> right. Exactly. Just because it's like that doesn't sound right. And I have to try it. I to make sure this whatever this is. <laughs> I, I've heard that they're just like really really sweet. But I I don't know. They sell them at the grocery store, not near me, but like 20 miles south of me, so I want to try them. Word. Sounds good to me. Like, right? Like, it's like they're there. Um, yeah, they're just cotton candy grapes. 
Watermelon is a very good shout. Yeah, Ben did say watermelon is his favorite uh, Jolly Rancher. Pie is yours then, watermelon as well? Yeah, almost anything that's watermelon flavored is going to be my go-to. I just love watermelon flavored things. But yeah, I, yeah, Blue Raspberry Jolly Ranchers are a close second though. Nice. Don't copy me, Pie Cheese Man. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Nathan, what is your favorite flavor of Jolly Rancher? Uh, it's been so long, dude. Uh, uh, I think the watermelon was good. If I remember correctly, I didn't really like the blue one, whatever that was. Blue raspberry. <laughs> Come full circle. Yeah. <laughs> um, Did you guys ever have the... What was the... I think I've had like every flavor of Jolly Rancher. I think I've only ever had Jolly Ranchers like in middle school. And they were like making rewards from tours for like answering like random ass questions. How would you feel if I told you I have a, th- I have a few Jolly Ranchers in my room right now? Love that. But I ate all the blue raspberry ones a long time ago, so they've just been sitting here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Let me see what flavors I have. Um, because I haven't touched these in a while. I'm a nerd. One of these are blue raspberry. <laughs> the no! realization. <laughs> and three of them are green apple, though. Oh. And one of them's grape. I only have five left. The green apple, I think, are my least favorite, though. I yeah. hate, I'm going to say hate, I hate apple flavoring. Hey, artificial oh, yeah. apple isn't great. It, it's definitely bottom tier. Something about apple flavoring and grape flavoring just don't, don't mix well with me. I like apples yeah. and I like grapes. Artificial apples and artificial grapes don't, don't get me. You know what? I will say the like I don't mind artificial grape, but um, I definitely prefer real grapes, and I def I way prefer real apples. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, ben agreed. Same. Too bitter. Not nice. Yeah. Apple. I don't. Yeah, artificial apple isn't really my thing. I love real apples. Apples might be like my favorite fruit. Maybe. I like a few of them. Bananas are pretty rad. I, I'm not a big, like, banana flavoring to me is probably the grossest. Oh, I would like, never try, like, artificial bananas. I just like actual bananas. Oh, see, the, I don't even like regular bananas. The, the only time I think I've had, like, artificial banana flavoring was, like, the, the Laffy Taffy. Laffy Taffy's? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's so I think, bad. Yeah, it wasn't great. I, I like those. Really? Yeah. I, I didn't uh, remember being, I remember being, uh very confused that this was banana flavored <laughs> yeah. yeah like it, i don't I'm, I'm not gonna say like it's it tastes like banana but like i like the taste ben has a fun fact about banana flavoring oh what Uh-oh. is your fun fact ben that make me wish i never said <laughs> that yes yeah, say it like, <laughs> I, <laughs> I there's a part of me that's like oh god what's he gonna say <laughs> um but I'm waiting in anticipation now. <laughs> I would say, as we're waiting for the fact, oh. The flavoring is taken from a now extinct species of banana, so the flavoring is so different to current banana flavor because it's no longer around. Oh. Oh. That is actually a fun fact and not a horrifying one, like how they make, was it, raspberry <laughs> lemonade or something? What? Uh, I'm going to look it up before I make an ass out of myself. Okay. Terrifying. I was gonna say, what's so scary about that? I don't know what flavor is safe anymore. <laughs> None of them. Cause, um, uh, it was produced so long ago that they haven't changed, and it's just so different now. Huh. Um. Oh yeah. So maybe this is okay. So raspberry. It's not raspberry lemonade. Apologies. It's the flavor of raspberry. Um, and a few other flavors, apparently. Um, let's see. Um, or made or often, like, uh, 
made from like beaver glands. Oh, oh. I know. Oh, I've heard that. Ew. <laughs> I love it though. It doesn't really. Um... Yeah. I don't know why. Um, because like apparently. Their natural, this natural flavor tastes like vanilla too. So I think vanilla stuff is made from it as well. Hmm. Brief history of castorium: the beaver butt secretion uses flavoring. Oh, yummy! <laughs> Cast, uh, castorium is a substance se uh, secreted by male and female Alaskan, Canadian, Siberian beavers. That's so specific. Yeah. <laughs> and that's Let's... in like raspberry flavoring you said? I'm trying to see if it still is. Huh. Um because like at one point it was. Interesting. <laughs> Derek, nothing. Movie theater snack server priced. Alright, but what type of snack that would be eaten at movie theater is your favorite? You don't have to buy it to movie theater. Fun fact, blue bananas exist and taste similar to vanilla. Ah, huh, never heard of a blue banana before. Okay, apparently it's not, like, very used at all anymore. But at one point, it was. Popcorn, I guess? I also like the fake queso you can get. Fake queso. Fake, fake queso, fake o, fake so, the fake queso cheese stuff. Oh, nacho cheese. Ah, uh... okay. Yeah, yeah. I mean, in... I wonder if like in Canada, it sometimes people call it fake queso because like here we always just call that nacho cheese. Like, even if it's not being put on nachos. So nacho cheese. And people can make the, the pun about it not being yours. Yeah, it's plastic cheese. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> it's not real cheese. Not even close to real cheese. It's queso, but it's like fake cheese, so I just call it fake queso. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah, it is like a fake variety of queso. Nathan, do you like nacho cheese? Uh, like on my nachos. Fair. You wouldn't experiment with nacho cheese anywhere else. Not really. Yeah. Kyle, what about you? Oh, yeah, me too, Kyle. Me too. I also usually just go for the cheddar cheese if I'm going to put cheese on something. Yeah, that's I, a fair I show. agree, Kyle. Yeah. Yeah, Ben. Yeah, Ben also said thank you, Kyle. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Kyle, you can't say that. Oh, Kyle. Oh, Kyle. Exclamation point, Kyle. Oh, guys, you can't. Sorry for Kyle. You know, you can't say that about that group. <laughs> Welcome to Fake Conversations with Kyle, where even in Fake Conversations with Kyle, he gets exclamation point, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> Exclamation point Pi as well. Pi does not speak for anyone but her but Kyle and herself occasionally. Pi is also high quality top hey, two. What did me. I do? Um yep. you shouldn't have said that, man. No, I got the exclamation point Kyle. Yeah. Yeah. I can't believe you said, said that. that. But I've been watching Mr. Beast's video. <laughs> 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 so I asked you a question and you didn't respond and then we like pretended you responded uh, and then I was like oh Kyle Kyle stop there oh no Kyle don't say that about that group of people and then exclamation point Kyle because even in my fake conversations uh, with you you get exclamation point Kyle just, okay that's right <laughs> um, what was the question though oh uh, do you like nacho cheese at all like Doritos. Um, but like, co Derek called it fake queso. I don't know if that, like, 
Uh, not, not your chi. Yeah. I would never have it by itself. Okay. Oh, I didn't. Oh, God, not by itself. But I mean, like. You know what I mean? I, would, yeah. I, don't, I don't just eat nachos with yeah. that shit. Okay. Yeah, because I. Yeah, nacho cheese, like flavored Doritos, I feel like it's a very different taste still than, like. Yeah, yeah no, I, I don't. Movie theater, I don't do movie theater nachos. I, I got them exactly once, and I was like, this is the most disgusting thing. Fair. Yeah, they're gross. Okay, sorry. Oh, no, you're good. Hey, you're watching a Lamborghini video? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I watched it before. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, ben said, all right, I'm going to head out. It's 2.30 here, and I do be sleepy, boy. Have a lovely evening, everyone. Ciao for now. Thank you, Ben, for hanging out, and thank you for the follow, man. Very much appreciate it. Brought us to 270. Hell yeah. Have yourself a good night, or as Ashley would say, good morning. I love that Ashley always just says good morning. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Oh man. But um yeah. I feel like for the movie theater snack, we got like a decent array of answers. Like a few popcorns, but even different popcorns and different ways of eating popcorn. I know Derek, uh Derek <sighs> apologies, Derek, but did you mention having popcorn with hot sauce in the past? Apologies if I'm labeling you incorrectly here, but I'm pretty sure you have. My memory isn't really that good, but sometimes I say things after Pi suggested it. Oh, so yeah, Pi was the original culprit. It's my favorite snack. It's yeah. literally so good. Yeah. So but it has I'm, to be like the right type of hot sauce. Uh, what kind? Well, um, there's not like one specific brand, but like there's certain types of hot sauce that you can like it, it would work. Frank's red. Hmm. That's the one, I don't, one, that's I don't the only brand I think that, I know. I don't yeah, consider that hot sauce. sauce. <laughs> that's not hot but sauce? I wouldn't consider it's it a hot, hot sauce because it's, it's in not half spicy. The hot sauces. What do you mean? It's literally not. <laughs> do you just call Frank's Red hot sauce not spicy? It's not. It... Okay. okay, this is coming from the guy who said arugula was spicy. Hey, arugula is spicy. Arugula. <laughs> 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 it tastes like pepper. What? <laughs> Wait. So, so okay. Time out. Does the does <laughs> the taste of pepper? Pepper is spicy. No. <laughs> it's literally a spice. That doesn't mean it's spicy. But we eat a mouthful of pepper. Okay. Tell me that's not spicy. Okay, I did. <laughs> pepper. <laughs> Nathan's like, yeah, I, I keep salt and pepper next to my desk at all times, just in case. <laughs> That's what the um, arugula tastes like. I feel like it's being a little dramatic about one piece of arugula. I am being very dramatic, yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, Burn my tongue and I was sad. Derek said Frank is flavored vinegar. Uh, and Chrome said, I feel like pie would bring a full fresh oven baked pie that she stashed in her purse to a movie theater yeah i can see that i would just walk in with it in my hands I don't yeah see her movie theater's so chill they just like <laughs> they don't care my friends and i literally show up with like we'll like stop by a restaurant pick up containers of food and just walk in that's crazy if they ever say anything i'll just be like hey you want a couple fries and then they'll probably be fine with it <laughs> and then have a few fries. <laughs> Bribe them. Exactly. Um, what was I going to say? I forget. Brain smooth. Okay, so what is a real hot sauce? Uh, <sighs> and, like, where is your line for hot sauce? Because, like, Frank's Red Hot Buffalo Wing Sauce, it's like... It's... It says it's hot sauce, right? Or are you just saying that this isn't a spicy sauce? I'm mostly just saying it's not a spicy sauce. Okay. Because I feel like hot sauce is a pretty big umbrella term. But I wouldn't consider it like a... I, I don't know. You got, your, you got your entry level stuff. Like your, your, your Franks and your Texas Pete. You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you could put like a bottle of 
a Texas Pete next to like a bottle that has been anywhere near like Carolina Reaper extract and be like, yeah, Texas Pete's a hot sauce. The last dab exactly. from Hot Ones. Oh my gosh, I want to try it so bad. <laughs> uh, and Chromo is saying that Frank's is classified as a hot sauce, but not actually spicy. It's very mild on the hot sauce scale. Yeah, actually, I want to see what's if it's the, like what's listed. The on That's this? exactly what I was Googling. <laughs> It's literally, the Scoville scale is 450. Wow. Uh, which is nothing. A jalapeno is base 5,000. <laughs> so yeah, Frank's is not hot. <laughs> Texas Pete is 750. But I, I also do think it is a matter of perspective, for sure, as well, right? Yeah. You're also, like, jalapenos, like, all, all those sorts of peppers, habaneros, they're fucking all over the place. You bite into yeah. one, you get nothing, and the next one fucking kills you. I was gonna say, I've definitely had some jalapenos in the past that are brutal, and then other ones that, you know, I could eat the whole thing, and it's nothing. Oh, yeah. Tabasco sauce. Yeah, I've had Tabasco before. Tabasco's nice. My dad loves Tabasco sauce. Tabasco is categorized as less spicy on the Scoville scales than a jalapeno. Um, but it is higher than... Like, I considered that, like, to have definitely a kick to it. Tabasco? At least for me, yeah. Okay. I'd say it's higher than, like, sriracha um, and cholula. Actually, and this one's saying cholula is more... is more Scoville's. Mine's saying Cholula's 3,600 and Tabasco's 3,700. All right, so one of these is lying, because this one's saying Tabasco <laughs> hot sauce is 2,500. Oh. Oh, wait a second. Uh, the heat level is steeped up a bit for Tabasco, reaching a claimed 2,500 to 5,000, uh, depending okay. on the batch. So gotcha. maybe they went to low end on this one and went to higher one on your end. Tabasco yeah. Chipotle is pickle weasel. I agree. Poggle weasel. Oh, no. <laughs> I just had a horrible idea for an emote in the future. Boggle <laughs> wassle. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Like, the people on Hot Ones, like, they gotta be dying. Like, yeah. Because the, the hottest hot sauce on Hot Ones is, I think, 2.2 million on the Scoville. And the hottest hot sauce that I've ever tried was like 1.2 million. And I thought I was going to die for a solid half hour. <laughs> I also have Last Dab. It's solid. Have you tried it before then? So I assume you have because you said it's solid. It's a dumb question, Tony. I want to try it so bad. But I don't want to buy a whole bottle of it. I had it on a pound of wings. Ooh. Man, Derek, I think Derek's good at spice then. Derek's, Derek's definitely better at spice than I am. Um, like I'm not great, but I'm better than, like, I'm better with spice than a lot of people that I know. I, I just haven't really been exposed to a super duper amount of spice. Like, spicy, you know? Um, things. Hey, Mr. Chef Piggy, what's up? Mr. Chef Piggy, we have a question of the week, my friend. What is your go-to movie theater snack? Uh, oh, getting through that pound was rough? Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, it would be for anyone. I don't yeah. think there's a single person that wouldn't struggle at least a little bit. And Chris Evans eats it all the time and still fucking <laughs> can't. It's hard for him. Yeah. That man, I... I don't want to know what's wrong with his stomach and his intestines. It's probably so messed up. Sean Evans. I think I said uh, Chris Evans. You said, yeah, you did say Chris Evans. It is Sean Evans. <laughs> Apologies. I, I didn't sorry, even Sean Evans. I called you Chris Evans. That should be a compliment, by the way. That's not an insult. <laughs> to be, if you're ever to be mixed up with someone for it to be Chris Evans, I think is okay. <laughs> uh, popcorn? Popcorn's a good shout. Yeah. Um, like, certain people, like me, I said, like, a candy. I said, uh, candy called Swedish Fish, and then Mike and Ike's. Um, 
a lot of people said popcorn. Some people said pretzels, though, as well. Someone said a chicken sandwich that they snuck in. Someone said no. Very too expensive. Not all these were everyone's final answers, but I would just like to tell you. <laughs> Options, you know? Yeah. Uh, I feel like putting on wings would make it a lot easier than to stray it up on a spoon. Yeah. Because the fat and everything, like, dilutes it. Did you just taste them straight up on a spoon? The one that I tried that was 1.2 million? Yes. Yeah. 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 My, uh, uh, that sucks. Yeah, it, uh, uh, it was not fun. <laughs> I'm going to tell you this in the nicest way possible. You cray. <laughs> my, I didn't know it was 1.2 million before I tried it. Oh. Um, I was at one of my friend's house and it was he's like super into spicy food. And he was like, yeah, you got to try this new hot sauce I got. I was like, okay, cool. Do you have anything to put on? He's like, no, no, we'll just take it on a spoon. And I was like dying. I started sweating, which I've never sweat. Like, I don't sweat from hot sauce, but I was like sweating. And I was like, how hot is this? And he, oh, it's a, you know, so-and-so mix of seven peppers. It's about 1.2 million. Jeez. <laughs> and for 30 minutes, I couldn't, like, think. I couldn't talk. <laughs> I'm just, like, standing in this dude's kitchen, just, like, sweating, mouth, like, tongue swollen. It was terrible. That's crazy. It was fun, though. <laughs> tongue swelling. Yeah, I had a great time. What? <laughs> <laughs> because it was a different experience. Like, I'm willing to try almost anything once. Like, I wouldn't take a spoonful of that hot sauce again because now I know what it is. But Oh, Derek said I can eat some last dab on a spoon and send it on Snapchat for you. I would love oh my to God, see it. Please. That would be amazing. Or come into team speak with it on screen. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll see. <laughs> Damn, that's you guys see like I would be willing to try really spicy hot sauces like as like a punishment or a challenge like stream yeah. or something. But, like, I'll pop in in a bit. Nice. You know what? That's, so we're going to, we'll wrap up in a few minutes, and our quality pre-show content hook to get people to stay will be to experience Derek eating very hot hot sauce. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah, like, I would, I would try, um some sort of you know like like every time something happens you have a little hot sauce I mean we we should do that to where like every time you die in a game or something like that you have to can't be Valorant though That's so, I would just wing. fucking die <laughs> it have to be like you know what it would be fun or funny is like I have to do Hot sauce shots in a Val game, oh man. No, like, I would die because, like, if we have a bad game, you could die like 20 times. <laughs> oh, true. I was thinking, like, because I play Pokemon, I could do, like, a Pokemon playthrough, and every it's a Nuzlocke, but every time a Pokemon faints, I take a, a shot of, like, hot sauce. And, like, the goal is to, like, finish that game like on one stream that's a great idea <laughs> that might be something i have to try to do or you start with 30 hot shot shots for each kill you take one less after the game oh <sighs> wait a second i kind of like that idea because wait a second if i get more than 30 can i make someone else take them <laughs> <laughs> like could i make pie take them uh if like <laughs> like if i got I, more than I 30 kills Okay. Yes, make someone else? Okay, these are all great ideas. <laughs> I might actually do these. Oh, that's really good. I'm gonna have to buy hot sauce. And, uh, I'll have to buy a hot sauce that, um, is recommended by the hot sauce friends. Uh, 
I say between Derek and I, we could end just some. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is this? It's a shots of hot sauce in the mail. It's for someone for a Twitch challenge. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Never mind. We will block this. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> that's too funny. Jeez. Yeah, I like these ideas. Um, I actually recently tried this extremely hot ghost pepper sauce. Really, just made me sweat from my eyebrows and everything. Oh no. Like, so how did it taste, though? Like, did it taste, like, super spicy? Like, because Pi was saying the one she tried, I don't know where ghost pepper is compared to, like, say, what you would have tried, Pi, the one point, whatever, million. Um, probably about the same. I think ghost peppers are right around one million. Okay. Because Pi was saying, like, her tongue swole up, right? Yeah, my tongue got swollen. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. I had a really if... hard time talking because one, my tongue was swollen, and two, it just hurt to breathe. Mm. So talking made it worse. Yeah. It doesn't taste of much. It's just like burning, just flames. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like fire. <laughs> Why am I eating fire willingly? <laughs> uh, yeah. To be fair, at least the one that I tried, it had a good flavor until it made me want to cut my own tongue out. But like, it <laughs> tasted good before then. Oh, he has it. Oh. He has the last dab in his hands. I see a computer. So. For our post- Okay, so. Friendos, this has been Backward Noise, episode 400 and- Six? Six. Six. <laughs> There's been so many of them, it's hard to keep count for me. Um, and I'll just catch- Yeah, my tongue burned and nothing helped. Even milk or water, nothing helped. Oh, no. No. But we will catch you guys next week. Stay tuned for some quality post show content of our friend Derek, aka okay, Discombobulate, drinking or having a little bit of last dab hot sauce. So if we can get a pickle weasel, wickle peasel, and or a turtle in the chat, please do. We Derek's doing last time? Yeah. Oh. Thank you. Catch you guys next week. Bye.